Hi everyone to my own tutorial. Now in this tutorial I will show you a very nice feature and a very unique feature of the Linux operating system and also for the Ubuntu too. This concept is called workspace. Now just do one thing you just uh, scroll your mouse and you will see something like this and again you scroll you will see something like this so you are getting quite the same thing but just the slide comes so, so what is the benefit of it you might be wondering so and and also you can do one thing here you can see this two box uh, you click on it nothing happened you click on it then you move to somewhere else that is called next one and current to workspace is somewhere here now workspace means that they are somewhat providing you to separate desktops uh, within the same account you know I'm the same user if I go to the other place here these are called the workspaces so this is workspace 1 this is workspace 2 so what's the advantage is that say in this uh, window I'm doing some coding things so I have opened my terminal there I have opened my text editor and writing so many things and all sorts of things you can expect I mean you can expect to for a coder so this is uh, about this terminal now by this time I also want to copy some content and there are some complex works for if I want to have some excel sheets I also have to take care of so I go there in the next workspace and everything is gone so there I may be working with some graphics application say GIMP so then I open my home folder right here say places uh, pictures whatever else I'm, I'm working on so there are certain windows or application that is running out here so say this thing GIMP app totally okay and you can see so here they are give, giving a totally separate place, place but we can do some photo editing work here and if I want to work, go back again to the coding I simply click here and I'm here again so you can see the flavor you can customize window as much as you want so if, uh, if you have done some coding okay is a not course in indeed in you know and then after some coding you want to get back to GIMP again so just click on this desk or scroll your mouse there on the desktop and you will get a new workspace now there are certainly no limitations on number of workspace um, they can be two or three four any kind of any number of workspace you can go in the preference and the preference you can say well two columns one row uh, make it for for me I want four workspace or three workspace and as you can see it has increased by four one two three and so many of them you will get so use the workspace for multitasking environment and in this terminal you can also copy certain files so things will get on copying here and when you switch, switch back yourself here and you can write codes here if you want to so this is the idea for the workspace and you can add any number of workspace out here so I'm just quite uh, satisfied with two so I right click on it and I go on preferences and there I make it to two again and I close it just make an enter to apply them you know and there are two you can see there are two workspaces and I close it so this is for the workspace thing um, you can obviously manipulate anything within the workspace so I close it mm, and make th this workspace clear and mm, the end of this tutorial counts <laughs> thanks for watching this video